Hello and welcome. I'm Courtney Burgess and I'm here with the Oshawa Honda where we've got city deals with a country feel. And today we're checking out this gorgeous 2014 Acura MDX with superior handling all wheel drive and the elite package in a gorgeous crystal black pearl finish. This particular model comes to us with two keys and a clean car proof. Under the hood, we've got a 3.5 liter IVTEC V6 engine with direct injection matched to a six speed automatic transmission with sport mode and sequential sport shift paddle shifters. This vehicle is capable of approximately 290 horsepower and 267 foot pounds of torque. Equipped with LED July headlights and LED puddle lights and rain sensing windshield wipers, so nothing's going to affect your visibility. Coming around the side, you'll see we're riding a top 19 inch aluminum alloy wheels exclusive to the Elite trim level package. And we've also got power assisted ventilated front disc brakes and solid rear disc brakes. When it comes time to hop in, you'll have no issues thanks to the proximity key entry system given away by that lock button on the door right there. We've also got our key fob with remote start, a lock, unlock, hatch release and panic button. Let's hop on in. Taking a peek inside on our door, we have our power mirrors, locks, windows, as well as our hatch release and gas door release, and our two position memory for our 10 way power adjustable driver's seat. We've also got our eight way power adjustable passenger seat and these incredibly comfortable parchment leather seats. We also have our all weather mats down here and no worries getting up. We've got the running boards as well. Just so, so beautiful and stylish. We've got our e-brake down here and let's hop on in for a closer look. Checking out our easy to read analog display there with our center digital screen and we can scroll through everything we need to see absolutely everything just too easily there with the help of our control settings right on the wheel. And I'm scrolling through everything using this scrolly ball with the eye for information settings right there. So it's just that easy. You've got it all. That's right in amongst our cruise control settings, including adaptive cruise control and lane keeping assist right down here. And then we've got our heated steering wheel. Oh, I love that. It's just a joy to grab the steering wheel, even in on those freezing winter days. Here we've got our phone and Bluetooth controls as well as the source and volume for the music there. Behind the steering wheel, we've got our paddle shifters, making the drive a little bit more fun. And to the left of the steering wheel, we've got our windshield wiper uh, cleaners, parking assist sensors, windshield wiper de-icer, lane departure warning, collision mitigation braking system, and traction control. All of these awesome safety features just right there for you. Back over to the right, we've got our double display screens here. The upper one showing everything you need. You can uh, adjust that very easily through the controls found down the bottom here, allowing you to cycle through camera navigation, phone, info, front audio, and yes, rear audio. We do have the rear entertainment system in here. We'll check that out shortly. But as we can go through everything there, we can uh, navigate through those upper things through the buttons below. The lower screen is a touch screen. You can see all these different ways to listen to your music. Just that easy. And this lower display screen, touch screen, uh, does have the combined um, climate control settings in there, including heated seats. I love that. And it is a tri-zone automatic climate control, allowing the driver, the front passenger, and the rear passengers to have their own separate zones. As we come down and check out those buttons again, we can see that it is a push button start. I ha actually have the keys stashed in the cup holder at the moment because I don't need to have them plugged into an ignition. They can stay in my pocket though if I knew I was going to keep them there. Below that we've got the in uh, DVD input for the rear entertainment system. So really you have everything you need just right there. And below that we've got our uh, little hidey spot with the 12 volt power outlet and that just tucks away so easily perfectly hidden from view. Checking out the rest of our center console here, we've got our beautiful leather up gear selector beside the cup holders. That little IDS button right here, 
we can actually adjust, hit that to bring up our integrated dynamic system, allowing us to switch from comfort, uh, comfort drive to normal to sport mode. And sport will allow us to make use of our paddle shifters. Very fun. And we've got our center console and armrest here. It does slide forward if you're a little short. That is an awesome feature to have. And if we open it from this side, we've got our shallow storage tray there. We can open it from this side and have that deeper storage access there. And I love that you can lift up both or one just depending on the side you grab it from. We've also got this beautiful cover here that slides right back, allowing us another way into that uh, deep storage area. And in there we've got our 12 volt power outlet, auxiliary outlet, and USB port, as well as this really cleverly arranged storage area, helping you make sure your phone doesn't get squished. Looking across the passenger side, we've got our beautiful locking glove box, push button open with our wheel locks inside and tons of space. Looking up top here, we've got our sunglass holder, our Tri-Link home remote system allowing you to hook up your garage door opener, your security system, your lights, any three compatible devices. We've also got your Acura Link Assist, uh, making sure that once you hook it up that there's always somebody calling for help if your car gets into any trouble. You've got your cabin lights and your power moonroof controls. Perfect for those bright sunshiny days, maybe not the greatest for today, but oh, it'll be so much fun in the better weather. We've also got illuminated vanity mirrors for driver and front passenger. A backup camera on here as well the moment you go into reverse and actually this is the coolest backup camera. I love the it that it shows you in real time not only where the guidelines will take you but from this view you've got a bird's eye view of your vehicle so you can kind of help visualize exactly where you are and what's going on around you. Just some awesome features and that goes away of course the moment you throw it into park it's gone you're no longer worrying about that and with all this awesome stuff i can't wait to check out the back and see the rest checking out the back seat now in a way that we can see the full range of motion in here in these seats we've got two seats in the front row three seats in the middle and in the very back, we've got another two for a total of seven passengers in this vehicle. Very comfortable back here, the 50-50 split. We can lay those entirely flat and no issues getting back here. We do have these buttons on the side and this little loop at the back that all produce the same effect where the whole seat slides as far forward as possible and leans forward, allowing you access back here. And with the range of motion in the middle row seats, we can make sure there's plenty of leg room for everybody. Here we have these seats, the 60% portion of the middle seat moved as far back as possible. The 40% moved as far forward. And for the driver's seat, we've moved that as back as possible. And the passenger seat as far forward, just showing you how staggered these seats can get. In the middle there, we've got our third zone and our tri-zone climate control, as well as our heated seats, meaning four out of seven of the seats in this vehicle are heated. Love it. We've also got our RCA jack, our HDMI input, headphone input, and 115 volt outlet, meaning you can play video games or whatever other entertainment systems on your ultra wide rear entertainment system. You can totally get comfortable here watching whatever you want. It's basically a normal TV screen. Look at that, it's huge. We've also got our headphones stashed here into our leather seat back pockets on the driver and passenger side. And you can really get quite comfortable as well. See those little clips at the top of the window? Those will allow you to hook the integrated windshield or sunshades, making you sure you've got the perfect amount of light to watch whatever you want on your ultra wide rear entertainment system. So let's go take a look at the cargo space now. Checking out the MDX from behind, we're just going to use our handy key fob, press and hold for that power tailgate to take effect. It does all the work for you. It's just that easy. And here we've got our the rest of our beautiful clean all weather mats and a little bit of snow. We've got these this great side storage area, perfect spot to put your roadside emergency kit. We've also got a 12 volt power outlet in there. Under here, we've got some lowered storage. Perfect to stash whatever else you need. And 
we can lower the seats. We'll just pull this handle and the headrest drops immediately. I'll guide it forward with my camera hand and it goes completely flat, just like that. We can put down the other side and then in the exact same way, and just like that, we've quite extended our rear cargo space and we still have room for five passengers. And there's just more room from here. We can lay it all flat, carry two passengers and have a massive cargo space. Cause you can really do it all in your MDX. That's about it for your quick peek at this beautiful 2014 Acura MDX with superior handling all wheel drive and the elite package in a gorgeous crystal black pearl finish. But there's still so much more to see and our friendly and knowledgeable sales staff would love to help find the perfect vehicle for you. So call, click, or come on into our showroom at Whitby Oshawa Honda at 300 Thixon Road South, just off the 401. Don't forget to check out our YouTube channel and subscribe to see more. I'm Courtney Burgess, thanks for watching.